Hello everyone, Sigmulator here. Welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West. Why are you doing that still? People to talk to here, there's more side quests to pick up. Did you now? Workbench I can use. So the Boom Sisters wandered back into camp. I knew sending you out there was a solid bet. And now, did you know? They have a new project to set their minds to. What did you do? Just a simple investment to protect my other investments. Mutually profitable, mind you. A good shardsman knows how to turn impending disaster into opportunity. And speaking of shards, you here to buy something? Let's see what you have. I have a new outfit. A more powerful shredder. Yes. Just grab that. There we go. Let's sell some stuff. Good fortunes to you. See you later, Abedant. If we're seeing yeah, only a part of it, how high could the old ones build for fortune's yeah. sake? Yeah, I'm not worried. 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 I'm Don't. I can only go down. Right, who are you then? Who, what do you want? Ask the sisters. What if we buried them in the sand? The boom traps. But then we might blow up everyone, not just the machines. Hmm. What are you two working on? Fred! We're making boom plans. Oh, we struck a deal with Abaddon when we got back. Turns out this place is going to need some security for all those machines out there. And when he heard how Boomer's invention helped you take down the vanishing dread, we convinced him we were right for the job. Now we just got to figure out how we're going to keep the machines away without blowing everyone sky high. Not everyone. The flying ones are already in the sky. Sounds like you both have a lot of work ahead of you. And a place to call home. Home of the Boomworks. Yeah, we're going to have to work on that name. Fair enough. Oh, come on. Get me up there. Oh, there's stairs here. That would have been simple. Pretty sure there's a rebel out. If you've got 
I should probably play some more of that strike game at some point. Stemmer, did you need something? As a new dream dawned for the adventuring trio, they returned to the depths of the formerly sunken city. Where fortune was found behind every crumbling wall as a bulging keg bursts with free-flowing ale. That is, we broke our way into more of the ruins below, and in one of them, the wordsmith beheld a glimmering gizmo a wonder among a sea of wonders. Alas, the gizmo lay beyond his grasp. You saw some kind of gizmo but couldn't get it? A door bars the way, locked by some confounded means. Moreland contemplated explosives, but Abaddon thought the odds of crushing the gizmo under rubble were too high. For once, the shard counter skepticism might be warranted. The old wordsmith's hopes were dashed, until a friend with a knack for performing the impossible returned from beyond the sands. Might I persuade you to venture beneath the desert once more? I'll see what I can do. Where is this place? Once you're down there, take a ride at the statue of the giant man. The ruin rests beside a metal tower. And so our heroine went forth, and the wordsmith's hopes went with her. Well, thank you, wordsmith. All right, so I need to go back down anyway. Okay. Where are the stairs? Oh, shit. Not what I wanted to do, but we're down now. I think I might have already got all these ones. statue that Stemmer mentioned. The ruin should be nearby. Nothing down there. I'll keep some extra on hand. Ah, stuck. Oh, goody. Inside the dome. 
Okay, I found a, uh, another fister point. You see nothing. Little shit. I think I'm in the right place. Now, where's that gizmo? That looks like it's going to be the way back down. There. That must be the gizmo. Looks like this door needs a code to open. I should check around the ruin. See if I can find anything that might help. Nope. There we go. What's in here? Gizmo's actually called an ornament. Found one of these in another ruin. It sounds like there are more out there. And it looks like there's part of a code. Might be for the door. I better keep looking around. Maybe I can find the rest of it. A hatch. Might lead to another part of the ruin. But how to get to it? Okay. There's an opening at the top of the fence. Could be a way in if I can find a way to get up there. Stop looking already. No. the opening at the top of the fence. I can't pull this out. It looks like the crate on top's blocked. Ah, uh, here we go. There we go. That's not gonna budge anymore. I need to move you to. No, I get in here now.
No, that's not going to work. Ah. Before I test that theory, can I do anything from here? No. Okay, so. We need to stack one on top of the other, I believe. So. Put you. There. Yes! I'm a genius. There. Should be able to reach the opening now. Made it. Yes! from this side. Well, I couldn't move it from the other side either. I won't budge from this side. You son of a bitch. Oh, okay. So why wouldn't you let me do that before? Oh, well. It don't matter, we're in here now. Let's see where this leads. were part of something called the Knights of Lights holiday promotion? A way to celebrate old world holidays by changing holograms above ground? Oh. Another part of the codes here too. I should have what I need to open the door. Excellent! Let's head back then. Go back. Okay. Oh. 
Oh, wait, do I actually have to read the code? Bastard! Um. Oh god, which one was it? This data points world night quest. Ah, was it these two? Marshall code. Just give me the code. I've lost interest in reading all this bollocks. This thousand or a minute will number eight. It hit the result in thirty seven to one payout net nearly three point two million. Have to rejuvenate his dream. A few moments later. Okay, I think I found it. Seven, three, nine, one, three, five. There we go. There we go. Oh. Jesus. Got it. Time to head back up to Stemmer. There we go. Figure out how to make this thing work. I'll go over all the other ones I found at the other relics. What's this? Oh yeah, the Vista Point. I think the image was taken from somewhere above the ground left. There used to be a bridge around here. Bullshit! Alright, why did... down. I'm only trying to kill you. Oh good, I can finally make some more of these. You done? There must be a whole network of these tunnels down here. 
water lines for an entire city. An image from the old world. Looks like part of the city inside the dome. I think the image was taken from somewhere above ground level. Maybe there used to be a bridge around here? Damn it. Oh, there's a bridge. I really can't see where this, the, all these obnoxious lights are making it difficult. Ah, hold on. That looks... Okay, so it's must be this side. There's a almost bridge there. Maybe that's the point. Here, maybe. Right, none of this is working. Mention an overhang. What overhang? This, ha this has to be it. Got it. Hey. I, I, I was already... I was I tried from there already though. Oh well, at least that's done. Right, good, I can leave. There we go, good. Right, let's go talk to the wordsmith. Okay. Turned, but did she bring tidings of triumph or misfortune? I got the gizmo, and it's not the only one I found. Here. The old wordsmith, a keen spark in his eye and gratitude in his heart, held aloft the gizmo that had eluded him. It's called an ornament, actually. Part of a set. Huh. You know, some delvers tapped a ruin north of here recently and said they saw a trinket like this one. Beyond their reach. Might have been another one of these ornaments. That's worth looking into. And so the mystery of the ornament deepened. For what purpose were these trinkets designed? Something called the Knights of Light's Holiday Promotion. It's a way the old ones celebrated special occasions, I think. Like feasts? Kind of. I think a holiday marked a seasonal event. 
And so does every feast in the claim. There's the feast of the first keg, the feast of fermentation, the all hops feast. All about ale, huh? I guess I shouldn't be surprised. Anyway, these ornaments could supposedly change the lights above ground, but I'm not sure how. Hmm. I recognize this marking. Saw the same on a little device we unearthed. Here. It might be able to turn on the lights. Hmm, time to find out. Which one should I try first? Let's go with this one. I'll get right to it. Ooh, no. Beneath the cascade of golden leaves, the old wordsmith found himself reflecting inwards, meditation of the mind, and a calming of the spirit. Let me know if you find any more of those ornaments. I know, right? But now wonder what other holidays the old one celebrated. Now look. So she entered once more. Our heroine, whom all adore. So, did you want to change the lights? Let's see this one. You got it. Hey, like sure as sparks out. kindle flame, this must have been some kind of winter festival. But what kind of beast is that? Almost looks like a fang horn. That's quite a nice one. From Journeys Unknown, the Nora returned to the teller of tales and keeper of ornaments. Let's see what these others are. So, what'll it be? This one seems good. I hope Abaddon is ready for this. Ah, this must have been the feast of the Crescent Moon. Couldn't have celebrated every crescent moon, could they? By the forge, that'd be a lot of feasts. <laughs> hey! The old wordsmith's heart warmed as a friend returned. So, did you want to make some changes around here? Uh, St. Patrick's Day. And so the wordsmith set out to bring new light to the ruins above. Why by the forge would the old ones celebrate some kind of green leaf? It's for luck, I think. Hey, I thought you'd left by now. No, hey, I'm looking at pretty lights. This old wordsmith is always happy to see you. So, are you feeling festive? Take your pick. Oh, Halloween. Let's put this one up. Blend it on this one, I think. By our heroine's word, the lights would dazzle the sky. This is stranger than a spark in a puddle. What kind of festival celebrates bats? By the forge during the party, what did they feast on? Excellent. I'll leave it there for now. And on that note, I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch this, guys. If you liked it, like, subscribe, ding that bell. I'll be sick of later. This has been Horizon Forbidden West, and I'll catch you next time. Take care now.